Hi, I'm Dr. Joe and I am to lovethatface.com and I'm going to show you a free three-dimensional cheek augmentation video of two ways that I augment the cheeks. This is a little trailer or teaser for our video series for sale online at lovethatface.com. We have high definition, detailed videos and lectures with numerous procedures, really from fillers to facelifts, eyelids, facial implants, laser, uh, otoplasty, uh, anything that involves cosmetic facial surgery. You can see these videos and purchase them at lovethatface.com and enjoy this free video. Um, we're going to do some cheek augmentation today. I've already numbed this patient, but just for demonstration purposes, when we numb for mid-face filler, we just put a couple tenths of cc of 2% xylocaine uh, subcutaneous so it doesn't puff up two the methods we use to augment the cheeks. Smile for me, relax. And the, the first method is what I call Olympic rings. And this is drawing rings on the infraorbital, the submalar, and the zygomatic region. The second method is kind of like a topographic map where we're kind of outlining the area that we want to fill, just like a topographic map. And the outer edges are would be the low-lying edges on the map, and the central part would be the higher. So what we're going to do is begin in the infraorbital region. Uh, this happens to be Juvederm Voluma, so we're putting this kind of in the subcutaneous plane, and that's our first circle. Our second circle is out here where we want our maximum projection that corresponds with hinderer's lines. And our third circle is so over So now we're going to uh, put some Vaseline on this area. And massage is very important to homogenize the filler. And uh, that's, as, that's as good as we can get with one syringe. Um, but that's certainly uh, an augmentation and that'll settle down nicely. So this is kind of the topographic map. I've redrawn it a little nicer. And uh, so the big flat circle, that's going to be our deep injection. So we're more in the subcutaneous or the deeper subcutaneous tissue. And this is kind of a tri-level injection. So the next level would be more in the superficial subcutaneous tissue. And you can see the three-dimensional augmentation starting to take effect here. And then the last level is going to be in the, almost in the dermis. And so you can see how that is three-dimensional. And that's really the buzzword for contemporary fillers is this three-dimensional filling. And by doing, uh, doing what I explained with the three circles or with the topographic, um, method is kind of an easy way. So whether you use three rings or do it topographically, it's important to augment the infraorbital, the uh, kind of submalar, and the lateral zygomatic region. And I think this will, this will be a very successful case. Uh, you know, filler, it's so easy to use. I could use probably two more syringes in here very easily, but we're trying to stay within budget. I'm Dr. Joe Niamh to lovethatface.com.